Hey, I'm Dan Healy. Welcome to Stat Beast. Uh, before we get started, quick safety note. Kids, don't play with guns. It doesn't make you look cool. It makes you look like an insecure wide receiver getting paid way too much money for having a worthless season. You don't take guns at clubs. That's what ecstasy's for. Or to a bigger stake, roof it all. I got roofied once, Dan. It wasn't that much fun. It's a good time, isn't it? No, it really wasn't. Ah, good times. I never slept like a baby. I've never been to Fishtown before. A big game this week. Cowboys playing at the Steelers. Steelers getting three at home, and conventional wisdom tells you to take the home team in a battle like this. The Steelers had a great game beating up on the Patriots. Oh. Sorry, Pitsy. And the Cowboys are only as good as Tony Romo is. I'll tell you right now, I think you should sit, Mary and Barbara. Fuck you, Barbara. Hey, America, I want to go on the way. Well, Barbara has got this with his right toe. He's on you. And the Steelers have the best defense in football. That's obvious. The Cowboys have five home and on the road. And the Steelers have been beaten from home. That's kind of unstoppable. So sit Barber. Make a chill list. It could happen. Well, I'm always a cutie. But still, I'm in this game. Detroit's coach, Rod Marinelli, has said they are not going 0-16 this year. That's not how they want to get in Canton, Ohio. I would try just shooting yourself in a club or something. Oh! <laughs> Who to start in this game? Adrian Peterson. I know, where's he been lately? Detroit's got terrible rush defense. Look for him to go strong this week. Two touchdowns, he'll hit the century mark. He might do that before halftime. You never know. All right, well, the holidays have come early, especially for Jay Cutler and the Broncos, because they get the holiday gift of their offense against the Chiefs' defense. Now, must starts for this game, obviously, Jay Cutler, Eddie Royal, Peyton Hillis, Brandon Marshall. On the other side of the game, you've got Larry Johnson. Start him. He's being consistent and playing that way uh, for Kansas City. Someone's got to, for God's sake. Broncos obviously win this game. All right, guys, what do you think? The Chargers versus Oakland. Go with the Chargers. He knows he's such a good player. The good news is LP is all over this game. After Westbrook had his big turkey day, this could get LP fire into the front, get out there and start running. I know, you have him in your league, too. He's got him partner. But this is the game LT comes back. Here's the bad side. Sit Philip Rivers. Rivers has a bad pass against Oakland, especially at home. It ain't cool being no job turkey so close to Thanksgiving. Let's talk about Cardinal Rams. The early Lions got uh, Cardinal by 13 and a half. I like it. They're going to win and win convincingly. Thank you, Al. Yeah, Kurt Warner is going to explode in this game against the Rams. Obviously. And so is Larry Fitzgerald. Right. Now, here's the guy we're talking about, Tim Hightower. He's on your team actively. He'll get some extra points for you. And there ain't nothing wrong with that. And if you benched him last week, which was smart, get him off the bench. Matt Castle, get him up. They're playing the Seahawks. Oh, the Pats are not going to play terrible after that. Um, get everyone going. Get them all up. Pats are going to win this game. Fitzy, Fitzy, Fitzy. Happy first week of December. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, my leg! I'll tell you, that Mayor Bloomberg's a son of a bitch. What a tough guy. Thanks a lot, Puffy. You jerk. I'll tell you what, Plaxico. go. Better get used to these bars, kid. Uh, that's week 14, everyone. Get out there. Have some fun, kids. See you soon. Like three and a half. I'd like to tell you the sisters left Dan alone in that cage. But that's how prison is. I'd like to tell you that. Did you hear that? Plaxico. He's out there somewhere. He'll all be dead before morning.